because he could have really been hurt. Okay. Now, I want you to look at the tone. Obviously, in the center, we had the same exact scene at the beginning. But the main thing we're focusing on here is the afterward when they were in the principal's office. When they were in the principal's office, which tone, looking at those, do you think would have changed Mr. Manette and Mr. Ritter's opinion on the consequences? Which tone probably would have gotten them referrals? Do you think it would be positive or negative? Show me which tone probably would have gotten them close to a referral. The positive tone? The negative tone. Okay, so the negative tone would have gotten no consequence. What about the positive tone? Do you think that was a little bit less likely for them? I mean, showing that they were concerned, showing that they were trying to help. Now, what have you learned about how being positive or being negative can affect the tone in this situation? What have you learned? When you're telling your story, how does your tone affect it? Martha? It changes the it changes the the way you look at it, like your view, your opinion, like whether you think it's good or not. Very good. Your tone changes everything. Now we're gonna look at another example. Instead of acting out this time, I want you to turn your pages over and we're gonna open up to the two different Venn diagrams. Open up to the first and second Venn diagrams. Now, the first one that we're going to do, um, Sierra, will you please erase what's in that Venn diagram? Keep the Venn diagram up. We're going to take a look at it. We're going to look at a negative tone for a movie trailer. And then we're going to look at a positive tone and compare the two. But I want you to look at certain things about the actions of characters. What was one of the other things that we see with the examples that we noted about tone? We saw what they, how they were acting. What about sounds? What was the one thing that we heard from that negative tone with Isaiah falling? What did we hear? I'm sorry. I'm sorry. So I want you to listen to the sound. I also want you to look at the colors that you see. And I want you to start writing down, I want three notes for each video that we watch. <coughs> Jerry, would you be so kind to get the list? Yeah. <coughs> it's so dark. Go ahead and number three for each side. If you fall asleep, they're going to kick you out of here. Sorry. I had another nightmare last night. I can't tell what's really important. Is there anybody else out there that this is happening to? Every time that I dream, there's always this. This is Mark. Is Remember, the left side is the negative, which is this video. The right side of the Who are you? Remember me. It's me, it's you, it's Dean, it's Jesse, Chris. There's no one more heads than it's Dean. We gotta stop this. How? Don't fall asleep. I haven't slept in three days. Right. 
the seven hour mark, insomniac will begin to experience micro naps. Means you're dreaming, but you don't know. Even if you're awake. three things that you notice about the tone. And I want you to come up with an adjective to describe this overall tone besides being negative. Remember we're doing the left side. What movie is this from? Make sure you're giving examples of some of the things that you see to help prove that tone and what you're describing. Now on the right side, we're going to watch the original Lion King trailer. And I want you to compare and contrast how the first one is different from the tone of this one. So we're going to do three on the right side. <coughs> presents its all-new 30-second full-length animated motion picture, The Lion King. He was born to rule. This will all be mine? Everything the light touches, but a shadow lies over the kingdom. I am a king. Run away and never return. He looks blown. I'd say brown is she cold. No, no, no. I mean he's depressed. Anything we can do? Not unless you can change the past. He grew up hoping to leave his old life behind. I know who you are. You're Mufasa's boy. You're the king. King? Have you got your lion's claws? You know my father? Correction. I know your father. He died a long time ago. Nope. Throw the game. Okay. Give me another second on that one. Now we'll be collecting these. Make sure you put your name on it. You don't need to fold the packet back. Just keep it on the side and put your name on it. What did you notice so far about the first one? The first video? What are some examples that show the tone of that one? Trinity? A lot of anger. Very angry, angry tone. Good. Can you give an example? Or can anybody help give her an example that showed it was very angry in the tone? Um, one of the lines was trying to kill everybody, but it just turned out to be a nightmare. Okay, so the lines were trying to kill everybody, but then he was having the nightmares. Okay, what else? Um, the dark colors. Yes, the color scheme was very, very dark. Lots of grays, lots of black. What else? Um, it was, there was a lot of screaming and they kept moving back and forth to like show the scary scenes. Mm -hmm. A lot of screaming. And what she said about the scenes, that was a really good observation. The scenes were moving very quickly and it changed the scenes into another one. It was very fast. 
So your eyes just kind of had to keep watching very fast. There was a lot of confusion. What else? What is added to the tone of being very negative there? Music. The music was a bit scary. It was like that, ooh. It was very, it was like those jolts of like suspense in it, kind of similar to what they have in a scary movie. What else? The colors were as bright. The wet, the colors. Okay, they weren't as bright, but as I thought he said, there was lots of grays and blacks and very dark colors. Okay. Now I'm looking at the other, the second video of The Lion King. How is that different from the first one? How was that showing it was more positive? There was confusion. There was confusion in that one? Because the, the boy didn't thought his dad was, and his father died, but you know, okay. he told him. It's, it's still the same video, but I don't know if I would say there was a lot of confusion. Was it jumping around as much compared to the first time? The first one had a lot more confusion where it was jumping around quite a bit. What else? Um, um, so Sunshine. Lots of sunshine. Let's all write that down. There was a lot of sunshine. So everything was very what? Bright. Bright. Very good. That added to that positive tone. The light was very bright with the sunshine. What else? He was getting better help than the other one because she tried to get help, but it wasn't helping her. Yes. You could tell that some there was some hope. Some good things were starting to happen for the Lion King. Okay, what else? The music, how was the music? It was more, it was, it was much happy. How else would you describe the music as being more happy? What other, what other adjectives can we use to describe it? Josephine? Um, upbeat. Upbeat, everybody write that word down on yours. Upbeat, the music was very upbeat. So what's another description you can use for that? Trinity? There were some more calm parts too. So this one, okay. Peaceful. Peaceful, okay. Loud and lively. Loud and lively for the music. I like those descriptions, those are good. Now, with this class today, I hope you've been able to notice the difference between tone and how it can be positive and negative. But what is the one thing that those two videos had in common? What were they all up? Lion King. So let's write that in the middle. It's very interesting how you can take a story and completely change the tone in the story just by changing the sequence, the wording, the descriptions, the sounds. Just like what you did in class when you were acting out the scene where Isaiah was hurt and you gave the story to Mr. Ritter and Mr. Manette. One way could have changed the outcome in the end of getting a referral or not getting a referral. Okay, now, um, looking back at tone versus mood, which one is the author and which one is the reader? Which one is the author and which one is the reader? Regina? Okay, very good. <clears throat> Let's do this. Thumbs up, one to yourself. If you were calling yourself something besides I, what would you call yourself? Me. Me. I want you to think, mood is me, I'm the reader. Just say it. Mood is me, I'm the reader. Okay. Very good. Now, author is which one? Tone. Tone. What in the word tone do you think would be a good trick to help remember that tone has to do with the author? Abdullah, he's almost there. What letter in author is the same in tone? T. The T. So the tone has the author. Good. So the author, what tone or the mood that he's trying to set for the reader? Very good. Would you like to watch some more videos like this on Monday? Okay, I have quite a few, and we'll practice this. Would you make sure your names are on those papers, pass them to the centers of the row? You can go ahead and start packing.